Hello, Kim. Good evening. Roger. Can you hear me well? Yes. Very good. Can you see me? Yes. Okay, great, Kim. So, Kim, how are you today? I'm fine. Very good. That's good to know. What's the weather today, Kim? It's sunny. It's sunny. Nice. Okay, so did you have dinner already? Yeah. Nice. So, Kim, if you can remember last night, we are done with listening part C, right? But you only got one point. So, this time, I want you to listen again and I will give you the chance to get a perfect score in here. But you are only allowed to listen once, not twice. Okay, so now, are you ready to listen? Yes. Okay. Can you see the book? Yes. yes. Very good. So now, please listen, and I hope you can get a perfect score. Here at this game, you can do it. Can you hear? No. This is done. Yes, this is done last night, but you only got one point. So this time, I want you to do it again and get six points. Okay, here it is. I will give you a chance to make it a perfect score. So this time, you're going to listen only once, not twice. Okay, so can you make it a perfect score, Kim? Okay, here it is. Listen carefully and write numbers one to six. You can 15 do it. D. What's for D? Listen and order the pictures one to six. Mm. William's wonderful honey cake. Hi. You might need some help, but you could make this delicious cake by yourself. Right. You need a cupful of flour, some butter, two eggs, a large spoonful of honey, and something else. Oh, a cupful of sugar, of course. To prepare, you should turn on the oven before you start and hands. First, Put some sugar into a big bowl. You don't need very much. There's honey in this cake, too. When the sugar is in the bowl, cut the butter into small pieces. Use a knife to do that. Then add butter to the sugar. Mix these two things together with a big spoon. Find some flour and put that in next. Then break the eggs and put those carefully into the same big bowl. Last, you put the honey in. You don't need a lot. Then you mix everything together again with your big spoon. Some people add carrots before they put the cake into the oven. It might sound really strange, but carrots taste great in cakes. You cook the cake for Enjoy. Okay, so let me check your answer again, Kim. So this one, we have put the sugar into a big bowl. Okay, then cut a butter, slice of the butter. Mix the sugar and the butter in a bowl. Okay, so that's F. Fourth, put the flour, that's letter C. Okay, five, break the eggs. Put honey. So for this one, you got one. Okay. Two. One and two. So, okay. So you, you got two, but better than yesterday because yesterday you only got two times two. So I will still give you this one. Small game. Okay. So do you have any questions? No questions. Okay. Now let's proceed with. So this time, 
funny, full sentences about your friends. Okay, so for example, Mary ate all of mom's meat at midnight on Monday. Can you please read this one? So this is an, these are examples of funny sentences about the friends. Can you please read Kim? Many ate all of mom meat at midnight on Monday. Tom had too many tomatoes at 10 o'clock on Tuesday. William had some wonderful watermelon on Wednesday. Tom took he to his teacher at tea time on Thursday. Fred had fish finger and fried at 5 o'clock on Friday. Okay, thank you for reading that one, Kim. You can see in here, Kim, that Mary starts with letter M. Mom starts with letter M. Meat starts with letter M. Midnight starts with letter M. Then Monday starts with letter M. So all of this sentence starts with letter M. And this one starts T. Tom starts with letter T. Too many. Okay, too many T. Tomatoes T. Ten T. Day T. Okay, so this time came. I want you to write funny sentences about Sue and Sophie. You can do it, Kim. On Saturday. Okay, so just, okay, so yes, Sue drinks coffee on Saturday. Okay, so what's funny about this sentence? So make it a funny one, just like this one. I'm going to make a sent an example, Kim. So Sue had a sweet coffee. Oh, wait a minute. So here, I will make it again. Sue had a sweet had a sweet um coffee with lots of letter s letter s uh had a sweet coffee and a spaghetti on saturday so i have in here sweet starts with s spaghetti start with s sue start with s saturday starts with s so now i want you to do make a full funny food sentence sentence about sophia that start with s you can do it kim mm -hmm. Sophia, mm. Sophia had a scarf and mm, on Sunday. Okay, Sophia had a star on Sunday. So what food did Sophia had on Sunday? Mm. Had scarf. 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 Okay, scarf is not a food, but maybe you can say uh, s. Also, here, let me help you, Kim. You can say, Sophia had strawberries. Or you can say, Sophia had six str 
strawberries and letter S. Please think of a food that starts with letter S. And seven. Okay, give me a food that starts with letter S. Sausages and seven sausages while wearing a sweater on Sunday. Can you please read your sentence? Sophia had Sophia had six strawberries and seven sausages while wearing a sweater. On Sunday. So you can see in here that we use lots of words that start with letter S, Kim. Okay, so Kim, do you have any Do you have any questions? No. Okay, now let's proceed this one. I want you to answer in a complete sentence. Let's talk about your favorite food. What is your favorite food? Mm. My favorite food is mm, is rice. Wow, rice. Okay. So who cooks most of the food in your home? Who cook most of the food in your uh, well, home? Uh, okay, so what will you say in a complete sentence? You can say, My mom cooks most of the food in my home. Can you please read? Mm. My mom cooks most of the home in my home. Oh, <laughs> cooks most of the food. I'm sorry. Cooks most of the food in my home. Okay. Food. Can you please read one more time, Kim? My mom. Please read. My mom put most of the uh, food in my home. Very good. Okay, can you please repeat this one? Cooks. 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 Very good, Kim. So now, Kim, tell me about the food you ate for dinner yesterday. Okay. Mm, rice, meat, vegetables, and so. Okay, so here it is. Always answer in a complete sentence. So what will you say? I had. Please read. Mm. All right, rice, meat, vegetables, and food for dinner yesterday. Very good. So don't forget to answer in a complete sentence, Kim, because this will help you to practice speaking in English. Okay, so what do you eat at home? Mm. Mm. 
Open here, huh? Eat mm, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Okay, very good. Wow. Okay, so so much for answering my question, Kim. So, Kim, we are done with unit 14. Now, let's proceed with unit 15. Do you have any question with unit 15? Yes. Okay, so what is your question, Kim? No questions. Okay, so what did you learn in unit 15? Mm, it's food. You learned about food, that's right. Very good. So what food did you learn in unit 15? What food did you learn in Unit 15? Uh, it is... Mm, uh, let's have a picnic. Okay, so my question is, what did... What food did you learn? In unit 15, mm. Mm, it is butter. Butter. Very good, Kim. Okay, so now look at unit 16. Can you see it? Mm. Yes. Okay, so unit 16 is a have a picnic. Okay, so do you like going on a picnic? Mm. Do you like going on a picnic? Yes. Okay, so where do you usually go to have a picnic? Where do you usually go to have a picnic? Mm, go to picnic, ride a bike. Okay, thank you for answering one, Kim. So now, Kim, let's learn the words from our vocabulary. I want you to listen, look, and repeat. Okay, plate. 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 Nice. Okay, so Kim, please say glass. 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 Very good. Okay, next, bowl. 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 One more bowl. Bowl. Okay. Then next, pepper. 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 Very good. Okay, so Kim, what is this? This is... This is pla plant. Plate. Okay, can you please say this is a plate? Mm, this is a plate. Very good, Kim. Do you have plates in your house? Yes. Okay, nice. So what's the color of your favorite plate, Kim? Mm. What's the color of your favorite plate? 
the uh, red. Wow, it's red. Okay, so now Kim, what's this? What's this, Kim? Very good. Okay, what what do we put inside the glass? Uh, it is water. Yes, we put water in it. Okay, so now what's this? What's this? Uh, this is a bowl. Very good, Kim. Okay, so do you have bowls in your house? Yes. Okay, nice. So now look, what's in the bowl? What's in the bowl? It is a vegetables. Yes, it is vegetables. Very good. Okay, so now Kim, what are these? This is a present. Excuse me. Yes. Okay, so now Do you like peppers? Yes Okay, so look at the peppers. What color are they? What color are they, Kim? Uh, it is a uh, red, no, yellow, and green. Nice. Oh, okay. So, do you have a pepper in your house? Do you have a pepper in your house? Uh, okay, nice. So, do you have questions? No questions. Okay. Next one, please listen, look, and repeat. A bottle. Nice. Okay. So, now, we have a spoon. Fork. Fork. Salt. Salt. Okay, now again, what's this? Uh, uh, bottle. Yes, okay, always answer in a complete sentence. Can you please say, it's a bottle? It's a bottle. Nice. What about this one? What's this? What's this, Kim? Uh, spoon. Yes, this is a spoon. Do you use spoon when eating? Do you use a spoon when eating? Uh, 
yes. Okay, great. So now what is the partner of spoon? What is this? Uh, it is a fork. Yes, that's right. So now how about this? What's this? Uh, it, it, it is salt. Yes. Okay, so Kim, do you like to put salt on your food? Do you like to put salt on your food? Yes. Wow. So what food do you put salt in it? Mm. Uh, it is salt. Yes, it is a salt. Okay, so for example, me, Kim, I like to put salt on fruits just like watermelon and pineapple. Okay, how about you? What food do you put salt? Mm, yeah. It is rice. Wow, you put salt in your rice? Yeah. So he says, do you eat salty rice? Yes. Oh, okay. Oh, that's really, are you sure about that? Are you sure about that? Yes. Are you sure about that, Kim? Yes. Okay, so now do you have questions? Let's continue learning the words from our voca vocabulary. Please listen. Look and repeat, manager. Manager. Designer. Designer. Cushion. Okay, listen. Let's listen. Oh. Can you hear? Okay, here it is. Cushion. 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 Eat. Okay, now next. Olive. Cushion. Olive. Okay. So now, Kim, what's this? This is... This is manager. Yes, it's a manager. So, Teacher AM, what is a manager? A manager is a person who manage something. For example, a business. So, a business have a manager. A manager is someone who manage something. So, in Chinese, we have this manager. Jingli. Okay. So now, Kim, do you want to become a manager? Yeah. Okay. So again, what is a manager? A, a manager is? What is a manager, Kim? Uh, it is... Uh, it is... Uh, it's very... Mm, very yes very cool. okay so a manager is very responsible because they manage everything or something so now kim who's this mm. 
means is Who's this? It is designer. That's right. It is a designer. So when I say designer, it is a person who designs something. It could be a dress, a house, a rocket, okay, a building, a shoes. So in Chinese, we have designer. That is a designer. Okay, so Kim, do you want to become a designer? Yes. Okay, so why do you want to become a designer? Because mm, because uh, it it like painting. Okay, so yes, it is similar to painting where you have to design something. Okay, but being a designer, they used um devices where they design. They don't use paint. Okay, I think. Some of the designer, especially the architects, they would use a pencil, okay, and a paper, okay. So now, Kim, what are these? Cushion. Yes, these are cushions. Okay, do you have cushions at home? Yes. Nice. How many cushions do you have? It is How many cushions do you have? Uh, five. Wow, you have five. Where can you see cushions? Is it in the bathroom? Yes. Okay. Can you see cushions in the bathroom? Here it is. Can you see cushions in the bathroom? Yes or no? Yes. No, we can't. We don't put cushions in the bathroom. We put them in the living room together with the sofa. Okay, when you look at your sofa, there are so many cushions in it. Okay, so now Kim, what's this? Yes, this is an olive. Okay. Do you like olive, Kim? Yes. Wow. Okay. So now, Kim, do you have any questions? No. Okay. So, Kim, I want you to look at ducks of cutlery and cutlery. Okay, so teacher AM, what are cutlery? Okay, so when we say cutlery, these are things that we use when we make food. For example, fork, uh, knife, okay? So bread ice slicer, so those are cutleries. Okay, so Kim, I want you to find the color it yellow. Yes. Find the cup and color it yellow, please. Very good. Okay. So now, Kim, there is a fork in this picture, too. 
color it blue. There is a fork in this picture too. Color it blue, please. What is use a fork? What is fork? Oh, okay. Back to our game. Look at this one. Fork. This is a fork. Okay, so what's this? Fork. Yes, this is a fork. Very good. So now, Kim, let's go back to this one again. We'll find the po. fork. Please color it blue. Nice. Okay. So for this time, Kim, I want you to write what you can see and you add one word to each of the sentence. So there is one example in here, Kim. Okay. This is often made of metal. You use it to cut meat. So this is a knife. Okay, so once again, you're going to complete the sentence by writing one word each by what you can see in the picture. Okay, so now, how about number one? Can you please read it? Answer, Kim. Mm. Most people put the food um, all around plate before they eat it. Very good. Can you please write your answer? Let's see if you know how to spell. Very good. What about number two? Please read. Okay, so please look so you can only find your answer in the picture. Okay, you can only find your answer in the picture. Can you please try again? I often have a... Where do we put? A cup of lemonade. Okay. So we have a glass of lemonade after a ride on my racing bike. How about number three? Please read. If you want to have some soup, put in in a bowl. Nice in a bowl. Okay, what about number four? Uh, only put a little black mm. paper. Only put a little black paper. Flavor. Okay. Mm. Uh, so, uh, uh, uh yes. Mm. What's your first answer? I think that was correct. What's that? Black soup. Black soup? Only put a little black soup on your food because it tastes hot. Yes. Okay, so look at this one, Kim. What's this, this one? It starts with letter P. Oh. P, it starts okay, with letter P. Yes, can you please write your answer? Pepper. 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 Not paper. Pe. Pepper. Pepper. Okay, can you please write Kim? Okay. It's P E P P E R double P. Only put a little black pepper on your food because it tastes hot. What about number five, Kim? 
please read. Uh, do you family buy milk or drink in a uh, bottle? Does your family buy milk or juice in a bottle? Oh. Mine does. Very good. Can you please say bottle? Bottle. Okay. What yeah. about number six? You can use a metal. You can use a metal. Mm. Knife to make different kinds of food together. Do you use a knife to mix the food? Yes. Okay, so this is a metal spoon or fork. We don't use the knife to mix the food. We only use the knife to cut. Cut, not mix. Okay, how about number seven? Please read. Mm. Dad adds Dad add a little happy no paper. So oh. he could eat. Dad adds a little what? Happy. A little please write. So this one came. This is the answer. Dad adds a little. Not pepper to meat when he cooks it. What is this letter S? Salt. Yes, it is a salt. Nice. Okay. How about the last one? Please read. I know someone. I know someone. Mm. They prefer who prefer you think. Spoon to eat rice. Okay, chopsticks to eat rice. So where are the chopsticks? Can you please circle? Yes. Yes, that's chopsticks. Okay, so for this one, you got one, two, uh, three. Okay, that's three. Three. Out of eight, Kim. So, do you have any questions? No questions. Okay, great. So, Kim, I want you to look at the picture. How many pictures can you see? Four. That's right. Can you please say, I can see four pictures? I can see four pictures. Very so now, Kim, I want you to tell the story. Okay, I want you to tell, uh, to look at the picture and tell the story. Hmm. Uh... Happy and sad. Okay, so that's the name of the children? Happy and sad. Okay, so how old are they? They are one year old. One year old. Okay, now what's the color of the children's rock sock? Mm, white. Okay, white. Now, what are the five things that they are carrying? Mm. It's bread. Okay, bread. Apples. Nice. What else? Chocolate. 
chocolate. And cheese. Cheese. This tea. one. Teas. Oh, teas. This one. Right? No, it is teas. What do you mean teas? Okay, please write. Please write. Oh my goodness. <laughs> okay, teeth. What else? One more. Ice. Ice. Okay, but I think teeth and ice, they don't carry it. They cannot put them, put it in their rock sock. So what are the, the things that they put inside their rock sock? Mm -hmm. Lemon and a mango. Okay, lemon and mango. Okay, so now what's the name of their picnic place? Maybe it's a park. When did they go to have picnic? Mm. White. When? What day did they go to have a picnic? When? When? Is it Tuesday? Uh, it Monday? Is. Uh, it is Monday. Monday. Okay. So now what are the colors of the flowers? White. White flowers. Okay, so now weather in that day. It sunny. is sunny. Okay, what's the color of the cow? White. White. Okay, what's the name of the cow? Angry. Angry. Okay, so now, what does the cow wants to do? Um, to hurt there. Okay. okay, wants to eat the apples. Hurt them. Okay, so you're going to base your answer in the picture came. So the cow don't want to hurt them. It just want to eat the apples. Okay. So how about number six? Six important words you can see in the picture. What are those? Six important words you can see in all four pictures. We have... We have fruits, picnic, children, cow, sunny, and flowers. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. So, Kim, this time, I want you to tell the story by looking at the pictures and looking at the hints that you answered. Okay. You can do it, Kim. Okay, so here it is. Please tell the story by looking at the pictures and using the hints that you answered.
you can do it. One day they are in a picnic and the car also in the picnic and they are and eat apples and they are catch mm, catch mm, catch uh, catch butterfly butterfly mm, um, and mm, and uh, they and they are very angry and the car uh, hurt them and they and they also hurt the car okay are you done yes okay so thank you for answer in here kim so in here, Kim, since it's already time, so we will just add here. Tomorrow, I'm going to tell the story. Okay. So Kim, before we end, do you have any questions? No questions. Okay. So thank you for joining our So I'm going to give you this one big star, Kim. So have a good night and see you tomorrow. Goodbye, Kim. Goodbye, teacher. Goodbye.